I'm pretty... No one down there. Someone in the shed? Doors covered in vines. But how is someone in there? Came in through there? How? What? Okay, I think I think Lee's starting to go insane. I think he's, he's starting to go insane. This is not a good thing. This is bad. But Clementine, what is she doing in there? Girl. Come look, right. look what I found. What did she find? How'd she even get in there? That's what I want to know. What's in here? No way! <laughs> That's so awesome! It's a boat! A boat! <gasps> wow. This was here the whole time? I know. I don't right? believe it. That's amazing! <laughs> We found a boat. I can't believe it. And there goes all the alcohol. I that's amazing. That just Wow, things are looking up and now somebody's gonna die. And it's gonna be someone we care about. Omid's gonna die. Kenny's gonna die. I don't know, Molly's probably gonna die. I hope she doesn't, because she's actually a super helpful person. Basically a replacement for Carly, pretty much. How's Omid doing? Omid's doing okay? Yes. As well as can be expected under the circumstances. I did what I could for him. Cleaned out the wound, but he's got a real infection. Oh no. Fever. Without antibiotics, I... Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. Why are you even still here? Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. I figure that's fair enough, don't you? Yeah, fair enough for me at least. Well, the you good want the news, good news or the bad or the news? Bad news. Uh, good news I think first. We could all use some good news. Good news is the boat's seaworthy enough. In pretty good shape, mostly. There's no gas. Mostly. That's the bad news. Gas tank's yep. empty, and her battery's dead. We need to fix oh, both before no. she's taking us any place. Well, how are we supposed to get that stuff? Who knows? Okay, there's nothing going to be in the street. Crawford. Sounds like Crawford is the one place that has everything we need. Maybe we should try there. Now, hold on a minute. Surely we have to try? If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? Trust me. You don't know this. Yeah. I do. You showing up with a wounded man? Might as well put a noose around his neck. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Covert ops. Because Covert from what ops. I've heard that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. There's sneak got to in. Be some way we can sneak in there undetected. There might actually be a way. Yes. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford mm -hmm. like the back of my head. Nice. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. We do. Yeah, we have a road map. I think I could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep their supplies. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. That's... Actually, yeah. not the worst idea I've ever heard. It's gonna be tough, though. I mean, it's close, but I don't know. <laughs> Maybe it could work. I've thought about it before, just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. And what do you want in return for all this help you're giving us? Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. So... It's decided then? Mm -hmm. We're going to Crawford? How do we even know where they store their supplies? That's true. I used to watch them from one of the bell towers just outside the perimeter. I've seen them carrying all kinds of stuff into that old Catholic school off the town square. Okay. I think they're using it as some kind of supply depot. There's a good chance we'll find what we need in there. I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. Mm -hmm. That boat out there is an answered prayer. Just gotta push a little bit farther. 
Are you in or out? I'm in. Say you're in, dude. Tonight, he he doesn't know what to do yet. I'll go Crap. Let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. That's how I'm still alive. <laughs> I told you to stay in your room. Hmm. How long have you been there? Is it going to be dangerous? Very dangerous. Be dangerous. Crawford. Yeah. I can't lie to you, Clem. Yeah, it's going to be dangerous. But it's the only way to get the things we need to make Omi better and get the boat working. That's why we have to do this. Do you understand? She's gonna ask if she can help. I don't want anyone else to die. Me neither. Neither do I, Clem, but sometimes we have to take that kind of risk. I guess I should go get ready. Uh, say what now? Hmm. <laughs> you said you'd need all of us to do this, and you said I'm a big help, remember? I don't want to. Molly said no. Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. It means it must be where my mom and dad are, right? <sighs> don't. Where it's I'm dangerous going for is children. Just too dangerous for children, especially. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. Great. Can't I come with you? I don't know if I can make that decision. I oh no I don't know why are they making me make this decision no she can't no I'm sorry or yes you th what kind of decision I can't I I, I don't I don't know yes but okay. yes you can come but you have to promise to stay quiet oh man and this is not just <sighs> okay I'm gonna go get ready this is terrible I can't believe I'm doing this. I can't make her stay here because she's right. We need everyone's help. She could be useful. She's already proven that she's very useful to sneaking into places, but I don't even know. I don't even know. That's a tough, that's a tough choice. I just don't know. This is bad. Check out what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, yes. some other tools. Might come in handy on this little break-in. Nice. Can I talk to you a minute? Yeah. What's up? I took another look at the boat. She's a 30-footer. So? So, we're gonna have a capacity problem. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, there ain't gonna be room for everyone. What are you trying to say? Just giving you a heads up is all. Thought you ought to know. Well, I appreciate it, Kenny. Oh, great. Who the hell is this? This is Bree. She can help us. Yeah, how? Help us how? I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. Oh! I know the layout. With her help, we're in and out faster. Anyone have a problem with that? I guess not. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. Why does she wear an orange jacket? Like, why is Molly wearing that? That's, like, not a good thing to wear for hold a covert a operation. You ready? Ready. Hey, whoa, hold on a minute. You're not taking her with us. Did you not hear anything I said about the kind of place Crawford is? If you take her in there and they find her... This little girl's not just excess baggage. She's gotten us out of a tight spot more than once. She's coming. Deal with it. You heard the man. Yep. Let's move out. Yeah. 